Quadratic functions, question number eight. Find the exact value of k for which the equation here has equal roots. So think of this as a quadratic. And if we were to have something like this, you can see this quadratic never crosses the x-axis. So here this would have no roots. Now if this quadratic were to cross this way, you can see that it would cross here and here, two different locations. And in this case, there would be two roots. Roots are where we cross the x-axis. So equal roots means there's only one solution. So we, we would either have this or we would have this here. So remember the discriminant, b squared minus 4ac. To have equal roots or only one solution, we want to set it equals to zero. If we set this b squared minus 4ac less than zero, there is no solutions. And when it's greater than zero, then there is two solutions. So what we have is our a value here is 5k. Our b value is k plus 1 and our c value here is positive one. So this is a simply a plug and chug type formula. b squared is gonna be k plus one squared minus four ac, a is five k, c is positive one. And we wanna set this equals to zero. We're gonna expand this binomial, k squared plus two k plus one, this is a minus sign here. Four times five is 20. So we have 20K equals zero. So we have K squared positive 2K minus 20K makes for negative 18K plus one equals zero. We can factor this so we can use the quadratic formula to solve for K. Recall that X is equals to negative B plus minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. So here we want to solve for k. So we're going to say that k is equal to negative b. Here's our b value. So negative, negative 18 becomes positive 18 plus minus the square root of b squared. Negative 18 squared is 18 times 18, which is 324 minus 4 AC. A here is 1 and our C value is also 1 all over 2A and our A value here is 1. So 2 times 1 is 2. So let's continue simplifying. What we have is 18 plus minus square root of this here. 324 minus 4 is 320. over 2. Now we can rewrite 320. So we can rewrite 320 as 2 to the 6 times 5. And of course you can draw a tree, 320, keep breaking it down, 10 times 32, 2 times 5, etc. You can even use wolframalpha.com to type in the, the prime factorization of 320 to solve it as well. So what we're going to do here is we're going to group these twos here. Each pair gets to escape out of this radic radical symbol. So we get 2 times 2 times 2. So we have is 18 plus negative 8 root 5 over 2. We can divide top and bottom by 2. So what we get is 9 plus negative 4 root 5 all over 2 divided by 2 is 1. So this here is the answer. 9 positive negative 4 root 5 are the values of k for which the equation has equal roots.